Hey there, kitten. What do you think you're doing walking around this way? Don't you know you could get killed out here? Uh, I see. Okay, well. Mind if I join you while you walk around? You know? <laughs> That's a good kitten. Alright. Let's walk. And talk a little bit. So, do anything fun recently? Or are you just doing hero work? Yeah. You gotta stop faking a hero, Ken. You know deep down you are a villain. So. Why don't you just give in to it already? Those kids at the UA school are not your friends whatsoever. No, they're not your friends. They're just acquaintances you made along the way. I should know. It's been a long time ever since I've been in there. Long, long time. And I ran away. Because I figured out the hero life wasn't for me. And I became a villain. Just the way I am. Perfectly fine, just the way I am. And I'm a lot more better when I have you, kitten. So, you gonna tell me exactly why you're out here? Or are you gonna make me guess? Uh, so you are snooping around to get hero's information. I see. I should have recognized this area. About to walk out to the UA building. Yep. You're trying to get information about the students, aren't you? Since you have a student ID, you can get into the building easily. But you gotta watch out for the overnight heroes that stay the night here for their night shifts. Yep, I knew exactly what you're going to do. You are smart, kitten. I'm not gonna lie, you are smart. You're very much smart. Um, are you looking for anyone specific? Okay. The blonde haired one. I've talked to that one before. Loud mouth he is. Who else? The green haired one. Okay. The white and red hair one. What do you want to do with him? What do you need to learn about him? Yes, his dad is the number one hero right now. I do know that. I know that way too well. Uh, I didn't say anything. So, is there any reasoning behind why you want these stupid kid heroes documents to know their quirks? I'm interested. Mm-hmm. Oh. You know, that is 
is awkward. To read up about the green haired one and to see that he was quirkless during his first year being here. That is a very, very interesting. Yeah, and the yellow one doesn't even have the yellow one. <laughs> you hear me talking and I feel like I'm drunk. Sorry, it's very late. Um, the yellow-haired one doesn't even have a hero name yet. Pathetic. Calls himself a hero. <laughs> what do you want to do about the white-haired and the... The white and red haired one. What do you want to do with him? I'm curious. I'm curious about him myself, actually. You see, I have some unfinished business with him. Oh, yeah, he did something all right. A little while ago, but I'm not going to get into it. Just gonna let you know. When I'm done with him, there's gonna be nothing but ash. <laughs> of course, you like me talking like that, Ken. Of course, you do. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Enough flirting with me. We could do that back of the base. Right now you're working, right? You're working? Right. And get that smug look off your face, because you are working. Oh my god. What time is it? Oh, it's past midnight. Be past midnight. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Oh. Uh. Shigaraki texted me. He um. He said he wants us both back at the base. When? Uh, now. <sighs> we don't have our main port of transportation around us, so we're gonna have to walk. Alright, well. You're gonna have to get your information another day. Ken. We're going back. And Shigaraki is the boss. You have to remember that. No, it's not fair. You're always, you're always acting like you are the center of attention. You have to remember, Ken, you're not anymore. You're a sidekick for right now. But, if you play your cards right, you'll become a great villain. You don't need any of those losers in the U.A. You have me, Toga, and Shigaraki to look after you. Yeah. Toga gives me the creeps sometimes, but she's just too energetic for me. It happens. Hmm. Yeah, um... I have a little bit of facial hair growing. Why does it concern you? Eh, well, I don't really grow out facial hair that much. You know, because of this. <laughs> I get this way. Well, 
That's a long ass story, kitten. And I don't want to talk about it. Uh, put in our shorter terms. Over usage. Yeah, of my quirk. Mm -hmm. But not for the reasons you're thinking. Like I said, I'm not going to talk about it. I'm not going to talk about it with you, that is. Because you have almost the same mindset as Toga. I, I said almost. You still are in that vigilante stage where if you can't decide if you want to stick to being a hero or a villain, Shigaraki is going to be talking to us about a new strategy that he's worked on. And he got a new couple of friends to help us out as well. Mm -hmm. Say they work with like, they have like special calling cards or something. He said we're about to meet the three-headed dog tonight in a text message. I don't know what that means, but we're going to figure it out. <laughs> yes. Yes, after the meeting with Shigaraki and the rest of them. We can go have our fun, though, Ken. Come along. Come on, go. We got a long head ahead of us.